Osteoarthritis is one of the most common joint disorder and is a leading cause of pain and disability worldwide. It is estimated that 1 in 10 of the population aged 65 years or above suffer from significant clinical problems that can be attributed to this disease. Currently, there are 650 million people suffering from OA-related disability in the world, and the knee is the most common joint affected. My leg was crooked, you know. So Dr. Tai, he told me, he said, once I, after the op, you can walk straight. Since the introduction of total knee replacement over the past 50 years, it has gone through many important milestones in the evolution of technology and the quality of the implants that we use in joint replacement surgery. However, none is going to be as significant as what we're going to see today. The arrival of robotic assisted surgery in joint replacement in this country. Traditionally, when we perform total knee replacement, we basically resurface the bone and insert the metal implants and the polymer to replace the articular surface of the knee joint. You can see, in order for us to do that, we need to cut the bone into a certain shape and manner. We used to cut the bone using conventional instrumentations and place the implants at the position that way we think it should be. However, we have no idea how precise the bone cuts are. Neither do we know the position that we place the implant is the correct position for that individual, even though we realize that every individual has different anatomy and functional demands. So what the robotic system allows us to do is to pre-plan the surgery so that we can customize the size and placement of the implant so they can fix the patient perfectly. It also allows us to align the implants to patient pre-disease or pre-arthritis anatomy which is specific to each individual. We can achieve all these targets with such high precision accuracy that we have never been able to do so before the advent of the use of this robotic system. As you can see before surgery, we generate this 3D virtual knee anatomy using the CT scan so that we can know where to place the implant and what size of the implant to use. During the operation, we basically execute this pre-operative customized plan for that patient. During the operations, the trackers that we place on the bone of the patients will then send signals to this camera so that the robotic arm knows exactly where the leg is and it will be able to cut the bone precisely normally within half a millimeter and the most a millimeter difference from what we try to achieve. What I have here is the exact robot that I use to perform total knee replacement. The robot cannot do operation on its own. It still requires surgeon like me to control it. What the robot system does is to place the saw in exactly the position that we plan and then the surgeon will press the trigger of the saw and cut the bone precisely. This robotic system will only allow the surgeon to cut the bone within the plan boundaries. Should the surgeon accidentally attempt to cut outside of this plan, the safety features of the robotic arm will instantly shut off the saw, meaning no unintentional damage can be done to the patient. Two 家里人都很开心一切都是顺利 We find patients who underwent robotic system have significantly less pain after operation probably due to less damage to the surrounding tissue They require less opiate medication, shorter hospital stay and less physiotherapy with faster recovery All this has led to greater patient satisfactions and allowed joint replacement surgery to become a more tolerable and pleasurable experience for our patients. 
Well, if you want a better life for a few years, we have to be brave to go into this op. La. Actually, I'm a very timid person. But when you are suffering, God gives you the courage. La. On the second day, I, I could use the frame. Dr. Tai did tell me about the op. From what he says, after checking me, he said I've improved quite fast. Whenever I'm free, I try to do the exercises. And I'm also going for a physio centre. So very soon I know I can be going out and all that. As for me, a hip and knee surgeon who has been doing joint replacement for the past 20 years, it has been an amazing experience to be able to operate with this robotic system. I have never imagined it is possible to achieve such accuracy in planning and execution of surgery. This is truly a significant evolution in the history of joint replacement surgery.